So you sit down in the morning with your cup of coffee. You check your email. Take a peek inside the server room to make sure everything's blinking green. Maybe verify that your organization's critical applications are available. But does your daily routine include ensuring your backup plan is ready to rock when you need it? Veeam's vSphere Web Client plugin gives you an at-a-glance view of your backup history, backup storage capacities, the ability to take a quick backup, and more. Let's take a look at it inside of our lab environment. So our first step was to point our Veeam Enterprise Manager at our vCenter server instance. This gives us the capability to load our Veeam Backup and Replication plugin. Now the top of the plugin has a count of components in my backup infrastructure, as well as a historical view of job failures, warnings, and successes. The bottom half of the plugin shows four widgets, VMs Overview, Job Statistics, Processed VMs, and Repositories. VMs Overview gives me a count of VMs currently being protected in my environment, whether they were backed up or replicated. Job Statistics gives me a wealth of useful information, not the least of which is the max job duration. Process VMs gives me a 714 or month-long graphical view of backups or replicas occurring in my environment. And finally, Repositories gives me a view of my backup storage and how much space we've consumed. Now at the bottom of three of these widgets, we'll notice blue links. These sync up to our Veeam Availability Suite to provide reports based on the topic at hand. For instance, with our Protected VMs report, we're able to get a count of virtual machines currently being backed up or replicated in a set recovery point objective. With our Capacity Planning for Backup Repositories report, we'll look at historic trending, scout out into the future, and tell you exactly how long you have until your backup repository runs out of capacity. Now finally, we also have the ability to perform both quick backups as well as Veeam zips directly from the vSphere web client. Let's take a look. So if I click on a virtual machine and navigate to the Manage section, we'll see Veeam Zip. This allows you to make some base configuration. You simply click the Veeam Zip button and we're done. Now if I right-clicked on a virtual machine somewhere in the vSphere web client, I'll have the option under Backup to perform a quick backup. Now a quick backup are for VMs that we already have a backup job established for but we want to do an ad hoc incremental one-time backup of without backing up the entire job. This is a great replacement for traditional VMware snapshots when performing changes or updates. So thanks yet again for watching our video and check out other feature videos on veeam.com. Have a great day.